In a moment, we'll look under those bandages, keeping in mind, of course, that we're not to be surprised by what we see, because this isn't just a hospital, and this patient 307 is not just a woman. This happens to be the Twilight Zone. The Invaders found out that a one-way ticket to the stars beyond has the ultimate price tag. A bill stamp paid in full and to be found on file in the Twilight Zone. A strong, simple woman whose only problem up until this moment has been that of acquiring a food deed. A woman about to face terror, which is, even now, coming at her from the Twilight Zone. The flight of Mr. Robert Wilson has ended now. Happily, his conviction will not remain isolated too much longer, even from so intangible a quarter as the Twilight Zone. What kind of world where ugliness is the norm and beauty the deviation from that norm? The answer is, it doesn't make any difference. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder. Lesson to be learned in the Twilight Zone. The cycle of going from dust to dessert. The metamorphosis from being the ruler of a planet to an ingredient in someone's soup. It's tonight's bill of fare from the Twilight Zone. A canimate. Height a little over nine feet, weight in the neighborhood of 350 pounds. Origin unknown. Motives? Therein hangs the tale. This is the Twilight Zone. The small man in the glasses who wanted nothing but time. Henry Bemis, now just a part of a smashed landscape. Just a piece of the rubble. In the Twilight Zone. Ahead lies a place called Earth the third planet from the sun. It's the eve of the beginning in the twilight zone. Behind a tiny ship heading into space is a doomed planet on the verge of suicide. This is a story that takes place on the eve of doomsday. Portrait of a losing side. Proof positive that you can't outpunch machinery. Three cheers and a unanimous decision. Rendered from the Twilight Zone. Battling Maxo is a robot, or to be exact, an android. Definition, an automaton resembling a human being. Only these automatons have been permitted in the ring since prize fighting was legally abolished in 1968. Two people facing the future with confidence. Having escaped one of the darker places, of the Twilight Zone. Prejudices can kill, and a thoughtless, frightened search for a scapegoat has a fallout all of its own. And the pity of it is that these things cannot be confined to the Twilight Zone. Summer evening, tree-lined street, typical small town, and then we pull the rug out from under your feet and we throw a nightmare at you, just at that moment when the monsters are due on Maple Street. <laughs> 